people i'm shita again and this is the new vlog about halifax that is a big city in nova scotia that is one hour away from wolfville and after a very long search of a lonely street where i can make this vlog and people won't think i'm stupid and talking to myself and here we are and it's a lovely day as you can see houses around and it's a beautiful weather today because from the morning it was raining like really bad and just now it stopped so I thought like why to sit home just go out and make some vlogs so here we are so today we're gonna talk about Halifax and <music> So guess what where we are? We are on one of the busiest road in Halifax and that's Quinto Road and here we have all kind of shops, flower shop, banks and photo, photo shops and restaurants of different cuisines, Korean, Turkish, a pet shop and whatnot, McDonald's of course and a lot more. Taylor shop also here we go so uh, I don't know what to make because <laughs> I'm new to vlogging so I'm just showing you around whatever I think you should know so there's uh, English classes also uh, church this is one of the church here Western church uh, what else people running having jogging sessions and what else yeah yeah So there were basically all the Korean snacks and kimchi and chicken stuff, whatever you uh, want in Korean cuisine, everything you can get it there. Like whatever I saw in K-dramas and movies, I saw literally there and I wanted to buy it but I know it's not gonna <laughs> feel good for me. So here we have some soy sauce and some of the uh, seed uh, wraps and stuff and I don't know what this is because it's not written in English so it was hard to get what it was so here we go here we have the buses it's uh, Halifax transit buses uh, basically these runs after like every 15 to 20 minutes you will get bus very easily even if you miss one bus you'll get another bus for sure so there's no worry about the transportation system this is the um, look from the other side of the Quinpool Road we have the Quinpool Tower, Scotia Bank and few more restaurants like Domino's, Wendy's and some pharmacy. So here we are, we are going to Atlantic Superstore. These are some of the plants left over of uh, Garden Center. In summer every shop have the Garden Center because Canadians just get four months in the whole year to plant. So here we are, we have vegetables and everything we need for grocery. 
So these are some of the um, fruits and we have vegetables also chopped ones and every fruit you get here fig pineapple avocados everything and here we have the apples for 5.99 and there's different a uh, whole new range of apples uh, wearing because of the color and the varieties these are the canadian grown cucumbers and tomatoes and i'll be giving the prices right uh, on the screen here we have the other vegetables uh, some of the vegetables i don't even know what they are called because i never saw it in india so these are the sushis and all the korean stuff i don't know why canada is like full of korean stuff also uh, more than indian stuff i saw korean stuff here <laughs> so these are some of the ready to eat uh, sandwiches and just to go food and these are also the ready to eat food these are the whole new session of chicken and red meat fish uh, tuna everything here we have this i don't know what it is tuna i don't know that's crab meat i will never taste it but i don't know like some of you guys who are non vegetarian and die hard fan of uh, fish and stuff seafood you will be very happy this is uh, indian session uh, where we have sorry section where we have naans garlic naan plain naan so these ones are not good i've tasted it it doesn't taste good but the first few these ones these are good yeah these are the breads uh, whole wheat brown bread white bread everything and here the cabbage is so small in india we have like a big <laughs> cabbage like and uh, cauliflower and this is broccoli like hella big broccoli you've never seen this much big broccoli in india i'm telling you <laughs> and this is dill uh these are the mm, some people use the kani this is me i'm stupid most of the people here are living on the canned food and ready to eat stuff so here we have some of the canned soups um uh, mushroom soup tomato soup these are the stews we have these are the broth chicken broth and beef broth everything here i am thinking what you are guys thinking the most important thing that spices so the spices we get here are these So it's not basically what we usually use it's kind of different for us but we have to use it no matter what we have to make it work so here we have like few items like five or six spices that are useful to us like cumin um bay leaves and some other stuff cinnamon and salt pepper these are some of the barbecue spices that we don't use that much but if you are like you know good at international cooking and stuff like making chicken and stuff you can use them also here we have the other spices also mm, this is the ground cumin and it's 7.99 dollars uh so yeah there we check the garlic price and here we have the paste that's like almost the same I usually use the paste because it's more, you know, in quantity. This is the sugar, and these are the eggs. And this is very stupid, but I don't know why the big box of egg is cheaper than the small box. Like it doesn't make any sense, but this is true. <laughs> these are some of the uh, coffee items, milk, and here you don't have to add corn meat in the milk because you already get the chocolate milk. So. flavored milk plain milk and we have the big bottles of milk also and yeah for indian friends whoever think that oh like in canada you are using so much branded stuff starbucks and stuff no because it's very cheap in canada that's why here we get like a ready to drink coffee also of starbucks it's usually here we have the indian uh, international aisle where 
we have empty already to eat food uh, we have pindi chana um, paneer masala and chane dal makhani but to be honest i don't like it it tastes it doesn't taste that good but you guys can try it's good for like to go meal if you don't have time then you can just microwave it and then just eat it and this is the ashirwad atta and we have other companies atta also but i have never used that so i don't know how it tastes these are some of the maida and besan and yeah here we have a uh, different kind of rice so basmati and dawat rice are kind of expensive here that's 15 dollars uh yeah this one and this is i think 4 kgs and it's $13.99 and here we go i broke my nail here very good shito very good okay guys so we are done for the day and i hope you like this video and got a lot of knowledge about the prices of here in canada and in india and the difference between the prices plus it's said that i broke my nail <laughs> reality okay so i'll meet you in the next vlog let me know what you want to know about and i'll give it to you so okay have a good one